Hey guys, so for today's video, I have been getting so many questions from you guys of what my thoughts are on the Jigsaw trailer and the Leatherface trailer, so I thought, because I have, can you believe it, have not seen either one of them specifically for this video, we're gonna react to them today. You guys love my react videos, so I thought I would react to both trailers. Now, obviously last week we talked about the Texas Chainsaw Massacre original film, which I mentioned is one of my favorites, so obviously I'm very much looking forward to a Leatherface movie. I guess it's a prequel. And of course I'm gonna, you know, the reason why I'm not as excited as you might think I would be is because I'm just gonna have a little, you know, gripe with the horror genre right now in the fact that we're only getting sequels, prequels, or remakes right now, and it's making it very difficult to find like new and interesting movies, um, and the ones that are new have been pretty bad, minus maybe two or three. So I'm a little bit frustrated with the genre right now as far as new movie releases coming out, but that being said, Saw, the Saw series is one of my favorite series of all time, and of course Texas Chainsaw Massacre is one of my favorite movies of all time. So I'm very excited for this video so I can finally watch the trailer that everyone has been talking about. And all of you have been asking me to share my opinions, so I thought I'd give you my first initial reaction. So let's dive into Jigsaw first. I guess this is coming out in October, so it's a Halloween film, which I'm very excited about because I don't think we've had a many Halloween films in the last few years, so I'm not going to share too much of the trailer with you guys, even though this is a react video, just because I don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> Yes, another group challenge. Okay, but that, that's been done, kind of, yeah? What's this music? This trailer, or this music is not Saw vibes to me. No, that's not creepy at all. Here's my initial thoughts uh, immediately. I feel like they're kind of doing a rings thing where, because originally the Saw films were supposed, there's supposed to be 10 of them. And at least that's what I heard back in the day. I think I was in high school when I heard that fact. So, you know, 10 plus years ago. Um, and I think that they, instead of making like a Saw 8 or whatever, they wanted to do a Jigsaw. I don't know, I don't really get the name. Um, I haven't looked into it that much or like why it's really called Jigsaw, not Saw, whatever, you know. It seems like they're kind of going a little bit more, I mean they've never been horror in, to me, they've been gore movies I guess. And made for like shock value, which I, I okay if I had watched these movies today I would not have liked them. However, because they started when I was in high school and I was, that's when I was first starting to get into horror, I really enjoyed them. There wasn't, you know. Uh, a lot of hype as as much as there is or was I guess five years ago or so. So I have a prediction that this movie will be bad um, and it's going to be kind of in the same you know category as Rings for me I think because although I know that the movie will be bad I'm still going to see it. I will probably enjoy it because I enjoy the original films if that makes sense. They're involving some comedy which they started to do that at the end. I wasn't a fan. The early Saw films will always be my favorite. Probably one through three are the best. By the way I did a whole Saw series here on my channel. I reviewed every single Saw film I believe. It's been a while but I will link that playlist up here if you want to know my thoughts on every individual Saw film. The trailer, it definitely looks like a Saw movie. There's a lot of gore it seems. They, it kind of looks like they recycle the theme of similar traps that they've done in the past movies, which I understand if you're running out of, you know, trap ideas, but I just don't think that they can. I think there's a million ideas you could come up with. Um, so that seems a little bit disappointing, but some of it looks pretty shocking and kind of new and different. So with all that being said, yes, I'm excited for it. Does it look great? Not really. Um, I know I'll probably disappoint, be disappointed in it, and I will re review it as soon as it comes out. Clearly, I can't speak today. Now let's move on to the Leatherface trailer. Uh, there isn't a lot of views on any of these videos, so I don't, I'm not really sure which one is the correct one, so I'm just gonna... Is this it? Well, this one's the premiere from Bloody Disgusting, and I trust them. It's a red band trailer as well, so let's just get into this one. Oh, 
already like this one more. Oh, so beautiful. one looks way better. I don't want to compare, but it's hard because I'm doing two reactions back to back. Uh, I definitely am more excited for Leatherface than I am Jigsaw. But Leatherface, that looks really good. There have definitely been some cheesy Texas Chainsaw Massacre movies. Um, I have not seen all of them, however, but the kind of more recent ones have been a little bit cheesy. I still enjoy them a lot because I love Leatherface and the storyline behind it and stuff. I'm not sure if the a uh, person in the beginning, the child in the beginning of the film is supposed to be Leatherface because he was supposed to have a mental disability and I don't know if it really showed that so I'm not sure who that is if it's a sibling or not I'm I don't know but I guess we shall see but that one definitely looks like it's going to be a lot better than some of the other Texas Chainsaw movies that I've seen I love that it's a prequel because you know, I love getting prequels for some of my favorite series, honestly. And I think it's a really creative way to do another film in it because obviously we don't really need another sequel, but it's cool to go like backwards and work with that storyline instead of forward. So I like that it's a prequel. So let me know your thoughts on the Jigsaw trailer and the Leatherface trailer, which one you're kind of more excited about or how they just look in general individually. Leave your thoughts down below. I hope you enjoyed and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.